morning from LAX Los Angeles International Airport and we are now flying to Asia. I have to say I'm a little bit worried because I got a really tight connection so let's see how it goes. As we are queuing here for the check-in, it's time to explain why I am a bit worried about this journey. Now, I am flying to Japan, but I'm not actually going to Japan, I'm just transiting there because I'm not allowed to enter Japan. So Japan is one of those countries that still has very strict entry restrictions, so I'm not allowed to enter Japan, but I make a connection in Tokyo Narita. Now, why am I worried? Well, because my flight to Japan is delayed for one hour and I was supposed to have a connection time of about one and a half hours, which would be enough to change planes. But now, because it's delayed, I only have 30 minutes to change planes in Tokyo. And that could work out, but it could also not work out. And I'm really worried because if it doesn't work out, I'm basically in the transit zone of a country that I'm not allowed to enter. So let's see how that goes. All checked in here at LAX and the person at the check-in desk from Japan Airlines actually told me not to worry because my connecting flight will be waiting for me so they know that my connection time is only 30 minutes and yeah that should work out at least I was reassured twice while doing the check-in so now I'm a little bit less worried but I'm still a bit anxious because it's kind of weird flying to a country and knowing that you're not allowed to enter that country so yeah let's see now I'm actually gonna go through TSA and uh, yeah American TSA here at LAX is supposedly very slow and very thorough so we will see about that and then we're gonna try to find a lounge so let's go all through security and I have to say that wasn't bad at all they do make you walk past a dog for a drugs check and then you know you just have the usual security checks but uh, yeah it was actually quick like 15 minutes so now let's go find the lounge no lounge for me today unfortunately I have only a priority pass I'm not flying business class and I also don't have any elite statues at the moment so normally I should be able to enter a few lounges with my priority pass but they've kind of suspended that service no idea why so I can't enter the lounge that means we'll have to go get some overpriced food somewhere I'm really gutted by this lounge situation. So I've had my priority pass for quite a while and I've never been at an airport where you couldn't find a single lounge. Now that seems to be the situation here at LAX. All the lounges that usually accept priority pass holders do not accept them anymore for whatever reason. I mean, nobody could explain it to me. I went to three different lounges. All of them said no. So yeah, now we don't really have too much choice, but let's see what we can find here. Last day in America, so obviously we gotta have some Kentucky Fried Chicken. Now boarding is in about an hour, so I'm gonna slowly head to the gate now and I'll see you on board my Japan Airlines flight to Tokyo. So see you in a minute. Now it's time to clear up where we are actually flying to. So we are flying to Tokyo, but that isn't the final destination. My final destination is Vietnam. And I'm super excited to go to Vietnam. Never been there before, but heard only good things. So yeah, I'm really, really looking forward to this. I'm also looking forward to trying out Japan Airlines because I've never flown on them before. I'm in economy, so it won't be super luxurious, but still looking forward to see what it's like. And yeah, I am still a bit anxious because I only have half an hour to change planes in Tokyo. So I hope that they will be able to make up some time and that I have a bit more time. So yeah, see you on board. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Hi, Katja I'm a low fan. Who needs business class when you got an emergency exit seat? Unfortunately, since I'm sitting in this emergency exit row here, you can see I won't be able to film the takeoff because there's no window. But that's a small price to pay for 
is much leg room. In the air now on our Japan Airlines flight to Tokyo and this right here is actually premium economy. I was upgraded without knowing about it. So let me give you a little tour of my seat. Tokyo Narita Airport and yeah I have to say Japan Airlines that was a pretty good flight food was good the premium economy product was good and the flight attendants were super friendly so yeah now they actually made us wait 15 minutes to exit the plane because well the people who enter Japan have to do some whatever quarantine interview some bullshit like that and I'm too tired to even talk about it but yeah now I gotta find my connection and I have no clue where it is maybe they've already left but yeah let's see I am in luck I finally know which gate it is and the flight is actually one hour delayed but we've already spent 40 minutes getting out of this plane so now I still have about 30 minutes to get it no idea where is the gate 93 okay interesting thing I've actually been here before twice to be exact at Narita Airport and it's not a bad airport but I really don't have time to do anything here I gotta get this flight this is really the tightest connection I've ever had to make and if this connection hadn't been one hour late it would be gone by now long gone and I would not get it also my body clock is completely broken it's sometime after 6 p.m. here in Japan and it's Friday and I left Los Angeles at 2 p.m. on Thursday but I only flew for about 18 uh, sorry 11 hours I, I am so tired I'm so knackered I have no clue what I'm even saying to you guys but yeah let's go find this gate 93 here are the signs all right where is it Hanoi 93. 93 I am almost running now because boarding started and I supposedly have about five minutes maybe ten but I'm very close to the gate I am actually gonna make this connection this impossible connection because well it has been late the flight was late it took us a million years to disembark from the plane because the Japanese authorities went through a lot of formalities but yeah we are getting close we are getting very close I have actually made it to the gate this is the line and we are boarding now man this was so tight but I made it let's fly to Vietnam I am so incredibly happy that I made this flight I mean the connection time was supposedly less than half an hour but the second flight was also delayed so basically the first flight was delayed for one hour and if the connecting flight had been on time I would have had no chance but because the connecting flight was also an hour late I got my 30 minutes back and I actually made it and yeah I'm now here in economy Japan Airlines let's see if this flight will be as good as the first one now, as I mentioned before, my body clock is completely broken. It's now 6.30, 6.45 p.m. Friday the 8th of July. And I left Friday the 7th of July, 2 p.m. Los Angeles time. And I've been in the air for about 11 hours. And then it took another hour 
to disembark and get to my connection. So yeah, I have absolutely no clue whether I want whiskey or coffee, or whether I should eat breakfast or dinner now. It's really, really weird. But yeah, let's see how it goes. So this flight to Hanoi is only five hours, but we got the same plane. And now is a good time to actually compare the economy product and the premium economy product to see the difference. And the difference isn't huge, but it is notable. So you got a little bit less leg space, but the leg space in economy is still pretty okay. Also, the pillow that you have in economy is a bit smaller than the one in premium economy. And you don't have a footrest here. And I think the seat doesn't recline as much. But well, that's about it so I was obviously upgraded to premium economy but I'm not sure if I would pay the 200 or 300 dollar difference in the price but yeah this is economy here and it seems to be rather empty I'm not sure how many people are flying from Tokyo to Hanoi at this point in time but I don't have a neighbor which obviously makes filming a little bit easier and yeah it's now almost dark in Tokyo and this is so weird. I mean, I, I'm really not sure whether I feel it's morning, evening, afternoon. I mean, yeah, it's just so weird when you fly from the US to Asia because of the huge time difference. So the time difference between here and um, LA is 16 hours, I think. So yeah, your body will definitely feel that. getting a taxi to the Airbnb and then just getting some sleep because I'm absolutely knackered after this journey so yeah that's the end of my little adventure here with Japan Airlines thanks very much for watching and see you next time goodbye <laughs>